This Tyrese Halliburton was inserted into the start. The Sacramento lineup. Kings is supposed well, to be doing good. Shook up the NFL's draft order with a huge trade last week, sending an array of assets to move up from 12 to third overall in next month's NBA NFL draft. They say they'll take a quarterback, even though they intend to keep Jimmy Garoppolo under center next season. What? The opportunity to trade up and possibly get a guy um, that can be a, a big part of our future and keep Jimmy, who we're very high on, and is, and is you know, I think some positive things are happening this offseason for. Um, you know, that's that's kind of the plan we arrived at, and we're, we're very excited. It was, you know, a stated goal that we needed to come out with the quarterback position being stronger this year, and I, I think we put ourselves uh, in an in a opportunity to make that happen with this move. NFL draft a month from today. It's Niners all day. Even on days like this. Days... When I don't show my true colors. Because my hands do all the work. And that's what I feel about this offseason. John Lynch has, hasn't really done a lot of press conferences. But all of a sudden, today, they decide to do a press conference after everything that's been going on in free agency. And a big move that has been made this offseason that has had a lot of uh, fans um, in question about the future of this franchise is the moves they're making at the quarterback position. It's just like I said in the first video, I was more concerned about progression of this franchise under the tutelage or under the reign or the administration of John Lynch and Cal Shanahan and it seems like I was pretty uh, accurate in my predictions as far as how they slither through these off seasons and how they go about their brick by brick process I'm very familiar about the building of the empire that was once torn down by what came before this new administration. But I'm also concerned about the so-called bricks. And the bricks that I'm seeing really tossed up in the air lately has been at the quarterback position. Uh, so you see, these last two Super Bowls, the quarterbacks have been held to a lot of accountability to the losses that have taken place in those two last Super Bowls that the 49ers have been in. This last one in particular has been the outcry of this offseason. That's for you. If you repping for these San Francisco 49ers in any form or facet, I consider you a family member. You feel me? When I see you at Levi Stadium, you feel me? And you got these on, you got these colors on, you family to me, man. You know what I'm saying? Anything I can get you, you can get. You feel me? If you want to get anything, and that's what I'm, and I mean that. Now, there are some particular fans that uh, have we've had our agreements we've had our disagreements and a lot of the disagreements is about the future of the quarterback position now uh, <laughs> shout out to the fan groups that I'm in uh, there was a particular fan group that you know during the course of this uh, off season there was a lot of controversy about the quarterback position and mainly who was going to start at quarterback because right now, as it stands, the starting quarterback is Jimmy Garoppolo. Now, when you say that name, a lot of people in this fan base tend to cringe. Hmm, wonder why. Regardless of the reasons that you have for feeling the way that you do about who is starting for the San Francisco 49ers, I 
as a fan of the San Francisco 49ers, am looking completely at what this front office is doing to strengthen the quarterback position. Now, there was a particular group that I had a disagreement with to where I was removed from the group. We won't get into that. But uh, I say that to say this. When the 49ers acquired the third overall pick in the NFL draft, they were quick to come, hey man, where Norm at? Because we want to talk to you about this because we want to see how you feel. We want to see how you feel because we know that you be rocking for Jimmy G. Now let's talk about how I rock for Jimmy G. If you're looking at this video right now, that means you are tuned in to Norm to an Honor Empire. Tune in, really tap in to Norm to an Honor Empire. Scroll down. Scroll down his uh, list of videos to see how hard he be rocking for these San Francisco 49ers. I haven't posted a lot of videos lately. Actually, not in a long time. Matter of fact, since John Lynch and Cal Shanahan have been in coach, I haven't really been posting a lot of videos. You know why? Because all the smack I was talking while Chip Kelly was the coach. <laughs> Mind you, I was still going to those games. When y'all weren't even thinking about going to games, you feel me? And I and I understand why. That's for you. I hope I get a ticket for next year, and I hope I see you there. I'm gonna show you how to turn up, like, like for real, for real. Yeah. Shout out to the faithfuls. This team is set up yeah. to really do things in 2021. You really pay attention. To what's been going on this offseason. If you're really, really paying attention, yeah. this team is set up to do big things. Yeah. And you worried about who's the quarterback? Yeah. It don't matter who the quarterback is this year. Yeah. This team is finna do things. In regards to what you gotta say. It's Niners all day.